Welcome back to the 185 reef tank. Um, I, my last video was the LEDs and Miracle Mud. And this video here, I am making it after two weeks of that because I have noticed I'm having some problems with some of my corals, mainly the hard corals. Um, I don't know why. I can't figure it out myself. I'm not an expert at all. <clears throat> but if you can notice the top of this one here see how the bottom's all green and the top is kind of bleaching out with some stuff on it. it's not algae it's actually a white kind of looking thing and I don't know what's wrong with that one and then this one here <laughs> this is basically all white except for the bottom trunk on it no polyp extension no nothing um, last week, I'm sorry, Sunday, I did a 20-gallon uh, water change and um, as like, you know, the regular monthly kind of thing. But, uh, you know, everything in here is, is not looking happy. And I can't figure out why. Now, I did a test kit today and, you know, here's my ammonia, my... Uh, my ammonia is looking good as far as color goes. Um, here's my carbon, and, I'm sorry, calcium and alkalinity. It's at 507 or 179. And then I got my nitrate, nitrites, whatever. You know, that color's looking good. And there's my phosphate, which is non existent. So. <laughs> Salinity is right at 30, 33% and uh, 1.023 1 or something like that. And everything is right in the parameters of what it's supposed to be. And at the same time, I cannot figure out why I'm losing corals. Uh, the timeline is still um, nine hours on the LEDs. And I'm, I'm guessing, you know, is it because that they're getting burnt out? Maybe is that why this is turning all bleached white? Because it's getting burnt out? Is there not enough uh, bacteria going on in the tank? Because I only have two fish. Um, you know, I, I have no clue. <laughs> but, you know, I mean, there's a couple things in here that are going good. And there's a couple things that are going bad. And um, I don't know. Why the, why the ones that are going bad are going bad. So, any advice would be, would be great. A couple of good things I did notice is that uh, these uh, caps are actually calcifying themselves to the rock. You know, getting thick around the edge and starting to branch out and grow. Same thing with this one, it's getting thick along the bottom here. It's actually calcified itself in the corner. And, uh, you know, it should be branching out too. So, yeah, frog spawn's always looking fine. Not worried about that one so far. Uh, Xena's getting a little bit bigger, liking the spot it's at. And then these zoos, actually, if you look closely, I have a couple new ones that are starting to spread out. So that's really good. This is my oldest frag. This this one is my oldest oldest frag. So it's good to see that some stuff is actually growing in the tank another cap now that is look, look losing a lot of color and I don't know why myself so and like I said any uh, any advice would be great I did notice in my sump with all this Cheeto the Cheetos growing like mad um, but then again that's not exactly hard to do but there are a bunch of copiopods running through the actual mix in here I don't know if you can spot one, but, you know, sitting around here watching it, sometimes you'll see them running through and doing their thing. So, uh, don't know why, can't figure it out, but uh, any advice would be great. Thank you.